Question 71. Which one of the following responses could the body make to decrease the body temperature of a person in a hot Turkish bath where ambient temperature is 40 degrees Celsius and the air is fully saturated? In answer A, we state increasing HE, so evaporative heat loss. Is that possible? Could we possibly lose more heat via evaporative heat loss? Unfortunately, no, because it states that the air is fully saturated. So what this means is that um, the air has too many um, water particles in it already and therefore cannot accept any more liquid into the air. So uh, we can therefore not lose any heat via evaporation. So A, uh, A is therefore incorrect. B, increasing HC, so conductive and convective heat exchange. Is that possible? Well, again, unfortunately, the ambient temperature of the room is 40 degrees Celsius. So what this means is that the um, person will not be able to lose any heat via conductive and convective heat exchange as the surrounding um, environment is already hotter than the normal body temperature of a person. So therefore, increasing conductive and convective Heat loss is not possible. And finally, uh, would increasing H total uh, lead to a decrease in body temperature of the person? Well, H total is the metabolic heat production in the person. So if we increase this, what's going to happen is we're going to have more energy that can be stored within the body. And therefore, um, if we, as we have more heat in the body, we will have a higher body temperature. So therefore, increasing H total would not um, decrease the body temperature of a person, but in actual fact, increase body temperature of a person. So therefore, C is not the correct answer. So this leaves us with D, none of the above for question 71.